What's going on guys? Today I want to take a second and spotlight a particular application that I don't think a lot of people, as evidenced by that, a lot of people know about this application, but I think if more people knew about it, they would find utility in it. It is called Reading Mode, and it's got some really interesting features. Basically, what I use this thing for, I'm going to go through the entire installation process, by the way. What I use this thing for is to basically turn any long-form web page, a news article, into a podcast, something that I can put my phone in my pocket and just listen to very, very easily rather than having to read the entire thing or you know having to be focused directly on it. I can put this phone in my pocket earbuds in and have this article read to me. So let's go ahead and install it. There will be a link in the description down below to this application and you can sort of follow along with this installation process because it's got a couple of little odd steps that you might not exactly know what to do with. So welcome to reading mode. Not only does it allow these things to be read to you, it also turns long content from apps into a format that is easier to read. If you want to just read them, you can do that as well. So the first thing we have to do is click on this settings thing and it's going to pop up and show reading mode. So we're going to click on that. So first we have to toggle this and hit allow and by default it's going to be set to tap accessibility button, which means you're going to have this floating thing all the time. And personally, I think that's just not fun. That's not good. It's ugly. But what you can do is you can tap here, untick that, and tick that instead. Now it's press and hold both volume keys to trigger this. And that's pretty much it at that point. We can now use this application. So let's pull up a news article. We'll just jump over to Feedly and see what the news is this morning. And we'll just go with this iPhone article here on 9 to 5 Mac. What we're going to do is we're going to press and hold volume up and volume down at the same time and it vibrates and now you are in reading mode. And what this thing is going to let you do is one, make this article very, very easy to read, but you can also turn up the volume a little bit. Let's go to about there and let's press the play button. Bloomberg iPhone 15 Pro will be about 10% lighter in weight, yet tout longer battery life. And you can actually go into the settings, change some appearance to this, change the audio settings, change to different voices if you want to have a different voice, and also make sure play in the background is enabled because with that, Life. you can do this. Apple is set Let's to come down here. Berman reports that the switch from stainless steel to titanium for the sides of the new chassis will translate. So I could put this thing in my pocket, put some earbuds in, and now this article is basically a short podcast. I do want to point out, though, that this is not just for web pages. You can do this with most applications. Messaging apps don't really work, but you can see up at the top, it's actually scrolling through all of these comments on my Reddit app, and it's organizing them all. I don't know why you would want to do this. And it didn't get all of them, obviously, but it will work on a lot of different applications. Increase the reading speed if you want to, to get through stuff quicker. For me, this is invaluable because I'm constantly having to digest lots of tech information. This is going to make that a whole lot easier. It's one of my favorite tools in my Batman style tool belt, perhaps you'll enjoy it as well. Again, link to this app is in the description down below. Guys, thanks for watching. Subscribe for more useful content like this. And until next time, stay nerdy, my friends.